Oh, there's a Queen Mary. Well, we're giving it away. Beach. Yes, we're in Long Beach because where else would the Queen Mary be? Yeah. Oh, it looks so nice. Yeah, so we are uh, at an undisclosed hotel in Long Beach, the highest Central. <laughs> and we just want to come and say to y'all, happy anniversary to us. It's our <laughs> third anniversary, December the 28th. Three years. It's been three years. 2017. Yeah. We got married in 2014, yeah. December 28th. Approximately one year after we met. I don't know if that is something known to you, but we figured it out like a, a year or two later. We started looking at pictures because I had pictures of the night we met in yeah. my Facebook, and it just so happened to be approximately one year to the day yeah. that we got married. So we met four years ago. We've been married three years. Yeah. So what's it like being Mrs. Gilliard? It's fun. Because <laughs> he's crazy. What? <laughs> I'm not that crazy. It's never a dull moment. You don't know what to expect sometimes. He is truly an alpha male, if you get that right. <laughs> Like uh, a, a roaring lion with a soft purr. <laughs> <laughs> wow, thank you, I think. You know what? Let me tell you something, though. Latanya has changed my life. Totally changed my life. You hear that pool splash behind me? It reminds me of how pissed I am I left my trunks at home. Cause I'd, be, <laughs> I'd be in that doggone pool. But she has changed my life. Totally changed my life. You've changed mine, too. Yeah, well... For the better. Oh, well, well, thank you. But I feel that way about you because it, you just... Okay, the other day for your birthday greeting, I said this. Whenever I'm down, you pick me up. Whenever I'm broken, I feel that God has sent you into my life to fix it. And I don't mean that in some dysfunctional way. I just mean it in terms of the momentary vicissitudes of life that we go through yeah. that I'm not alone. And you're on my team. You're on my side. And yeah, I'm on your side and on your team too. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? This is totally a team. This is totally a team. So, don't you love her hair? Look at how sexy she looks. Look at, look at, look at her. <laughs> oh wait, well, uh, well, it's not, it's not pointing, but I'm pointing anyway. She looks. Oh, you look good. Yeah, Damn, the fro is back. You look fine. You know, you look fine. Oh, the fro is back. Hell. <laughs> so, uh. We're in Long Beach, and we're gonna go to the Long Beach. Is that no, the we're Queen going Mary? To the Queen Mary? No, that's the Queen Mary right there. Yeah, right there. Docked. Yeah. So we're gonna go to the Queen Mary later on. I've never been yeah. to the Queen Mary. I've I lived, haven't either. I've lived in LA for 32 years and never been to the Queen Mary ever. Yeah, I'm excited about it. And so we're gonna go to some restaurant there. Oh, I forget the name of it, but it's no, there. We're going to the Queen Mary. On the, we're gonna eat on the Queen Mary. Yeah, but there's a restaurant on there called something, and I can't remember the name of it. But we oh, have reservations at 7:30. It's on the boat. It's on the boat. And the prices are damn high. <laughs> That's not why we deserve it. <laughs> we deserve it. Yeah, so anyway. It's um, going to be a lot of fun. You know, you know I mentioned this to you Simplicity. earlier. Simplicity. I'm going to talk to you about this. This is what we're going to talk about to people about. What? So, um, five years ago, um, I noticed in my circle a bunch of miserable marriages. Marriages falling apart, marriages, people not getting along, people on the verge of divorce and have since divorced. Some haven't. Some have survived and are doing well now. Around me, today, there are a slew of happily married people. Yeah. Why do you think that is? I don't know. Maybe it's because of what you, you, you attract what you are. No. And we are happily married, so <laughs> I don't think we're gonna be around any people that are miserably married. That's true. Because yeah. by the time we finish dealing with them, something's gonna change. Mm, that's you true. Know? That's true. That's true. Yeah. I mean, it's hope. We we have been hope because we've been through this so many times. Oh Lord, please. Do you the must games are the games are over. Mm -hmm. The crazy unfair fighting that's over. unfair fighting you know that i think is the main key because uh, people may not know this but let's let them in on our secret mm -hmm. we definitely fight oh yeah and, and she don't like a lot of things i do <laughs> and a lot of things i say i know she does not like do you yeah and there's some things about me that he just can't get into either oh so. <laughs> <laughs> yeah but you know what though but and, we work but i accept though you know i do i accept, I accept the things you accept yeah me. i you know the things that he doesn't try to change me and i don't try to change you know what's me. hilarious about it though even the stuff that you do that i may not be into mm -hmm. i accept them 
That's because you love me. And even when you push it on me, <laughs> I, I even let you push it on me. <laughs> That's like, okay, push it on me. Because it's probably better for me anyway. You know, I was raised in yeah. Chicago in the 60s. You know, we had chitlins and fried greens and <laughs> fried everything. And you know, Crisco oil and all that stuff. And you won't let me do Crisco no more. And it pisses oh, me no, off. No, no, no. I like Crisco. It doesn't piss you off. It's my history. But there are things <laughs> that about us, you know, that changes for the good. But first of all, you got to be willing to change. And, and that's what we are with each other. Yeah. So new people that get married, you got to be willing to change because that's what the game is all about. You got to be able to change and you got to be able to accept certain things about the person because you do, number one, you love them so much, you can't see your life without them. Mm -hmm. And hopefully you're wise enough to not get into something where, you know, they just make you miserable, mm -hmm. you know? So yeah. we're not gonna keep you long because we got some exploring to do. And my arms are hurting and yeah. we lost our selfie stick. <laughs> but at least I lost my selfie stick. My wife gave yeah. me a selfie stick and I can't find a doggone thing. <laughs> so anyway, that's all we got to say for now. Anything yeah. else you want to say, honey? No, but we are we are happy and look out for us in 2018. Look out for us in 2018. Not that goofiness. Well, maybe the goofiness, but. <laughs> but it's going to be great. Woo! We got some big things coming and doors are opening. God is good. More please, more please. That's all I ever say. More please, more please. Yes. And you know what I found out too? Is that happiness, it starts in your own heart and in your own mind. It's an inside job. You know, you yeah. can have living in a Bruce Wayne mansion and be miserable and sad. And you can live in a one bedroom apartment in Van Nuys. Yep. <laughs> with a rollaway bed in the living room and be happy. Yes. True that. That's it. All right, gotta go? All right. Uh, Enjoy your holiday. Happy, happy New Year to you all. Happy anniversary. Thank you for taking happy this ride with us. Happy anniversary. Yeah. Do you know what day today day is? It's our anniversary. So good today, John. It's anniversary. <laughs> Goodbye, everybody. So in